Francie Rewald never wanted a plain home. Yes, I love to recycle and I love green greenhouses and uh, contemporary architecture. She's looking for something a little different. My mom's definitely a hippie at heart, so it's very appropriate <laughs> to be living in the mountains in Malibu in a self-sustainable house. Try a house made from recycled materials. You know, we all are very familiar with recycling aluminum cans, uh, and we're just trying to do that on a larger scale. A plane, that is, and that's anything but ordinary. Rewald is using a junked 747 airline to build her new abode. I said, yes, let's do it. But first, let's go look at an airplane. <laughs> let's go find one so we can see what it looks like. Because I wanted something that was sleek. They plan on using every bit of this junk jet. And we're taking it all apart and, and using the various components around the site so that we're not wasting any more of it. The hard part is getting the jumbo to its new home. It had to be cut up. The wings, too large to be trucked into the Malibu, California hills, took flight courtesy of a helicopter. The new passenger jet carries a $200 million price tag. They got this one for a steal. To reclaim the aircraft in its... Uh, full condition was $40,000. The house itself will cost $2 million to build. When it's cleared for landing, the old fuselage will function as an art studio. And we're going to tip the nose of the aircraft up as a, as a meditation pavilion. The wings will be the home's roof. Rewald hired architects who are well known for building green homes from reclaimed and natural materials. This is the first they've put together from a giant aircraft. It looks great! It looks so amazing! And now Francie Rewald will be the only kid on her block with a bungalow made from a Boeing. John Moan, the Associated Press, Malibu, California.